the one area where there is very poor legal representation from the indic perspective which is possible under the current legal framework without the need for any amendment is in all environmental actions there is and there has to be in a uh, indic representation there is no indic representation whatsoever environmental jurisprudence under the current legal framework in this country literally draws from random theories literally draws from western theories there is no set pattern there is no set framework whatsoever in fact when they speak of sustainable development there is a tendency to selectively quote from certain instruments international instruments without even asking how does sustainable development apply to an indian perspective or to an indian situation so